are getting to see this. The reaction though so far has been, uh, what do you tell me, you tell me, how's the reaction been? It's been better than we could have uh, imagined. You know, we've had um, a lot of, um, you know, we really wanted to kind of go back to the old Mortal Kombat, but we were wondering how people would be receptive to that. They could, it couldn't have been a more positive uh, reaction that we've gotten. Um, we've also added uh, like a tag team mode. It's not new, tag team isn't new to fighting games, but we've added a really cool twist to it. Uh, really letting uh, the individuality of the characters stand out. These guys are going to demonstrate things like, you know, <clears throat> you can start a combo with one character, the other one comes in, finishes it up. You can literally swap back and forth between them. It there. makes some insane uh, uh, combos with the game. So you see everybody's kind of got their little intro. Johnny Cage is the cocky guy, and Shaolin's the, you know, Kung Lao's like the Shaolin monk. So watch the guys kind of swap in and out as they had before. Uh -huh. The characters kind of have a little personality of going out. Nightwolf actually disappears. Oh, wow. Johnny Cage Johnny is this kind of like a little cocky thing when he when he swaps out. And but you can also have you can characters can come in with an attack. So like if you start you can start a combo and then finish it off with another character going in. So imagine the kind of combinations of um, one character with other characters, the, the, the right. matchups that people are going to have in terms of you know making their favorite oh, yeah. tag team matchups. All so. kinds of crazy stuff with that. Yeah, we also have an, an assist move where the where the character you can call in your partner. He does a special move and then leaves right away. So it's kind of like borrowing a special move from your character. Um, these guys can really watch. But we'll let these guys kind of cut loose while we're talking and show some of the really cool uh, combos that you could do with the uh, matchups that they have. Now, obviously, uh, fatalities. You know, I imagine, imagine you're just sticking that way because it looks like you're going definitely for the gritty or hardcore, awesome, you know, Mortal Kombat. Yeah. Did you guys, do you guys mix in any other finishing moves in terms of like any of the stuff we've seen outside of fatalities? Yeah, you know, we have this. The X-ray move is using a lot of the same kind of core technology that that was done in. Uh, <laughs> we have our insides of our characters are actually modeled, so that really comes in handy when it comes to. Uh, fatalities as well as these x-ray modes so again it just kind of creates for a, a much more brutal experience with the uh, the overall fighting so no friendships in this one then i take it no we're real serious <laughs> about right. this time i better get some of these time. questions in the audience if you don't mind as we're, okay, we're, yeah. we're, as we're talking uh oh actually yeah stefan magnuson of sweden asked the same question i did uh, we heard about that uh, what kind of game modes will there be uh obviously fighting games nowadays you know everybody's looking for online getting that going can sure. you talk about what, some of the stuff oh wow Sure. Yeah, we have the sing <laughs> the single player combat as well as the uh, you know the tag team one. But in terms of online, you can do a, a quick single player match, an online match. You can have two guys on one machine fighting a team against two guys on another on another uh, machine online. We can have eight guys in a room, and they're all kind of like in the spectator view. The spectators will be kind of lined up on the bottom, all participating, giving comments, respect points, cool. and the respect points kind of accumulate for trophies and, and achievements and all that. So it's really tied, there's a really heavy tie in with the online uh, performance and your, you know, trophies and achievements. I got you. Yeah. The, uh, as we watch Molina and Johnny Cage work, now this is again another, uh, another environmental Fatality level, correct? Yeah, you know, the, um, <clears throat> this is the, the pit for Mortal Kombat 2, you know, and again, a lot of these backgrounds we've kind of just reimagined with a, um, you know, our current technology, so we can do a lot more elaborate in terms of uh, how we present it. We have these guys on hooks, they get lowered down into the ass and they come up as, uh, oh, yeah, as skeletons one, one there. The yeah, there. so those, those were a uh, full body. Before we run out of time, oh, I guess I'm gonna be quiet. Huh? <laughs> Definitely mature. <laughs> well, that's super awesome, you guys. Yeah, so that's Mortal Kombat. First, I look outside of my thing. We're excited about it. Super excited. Uh, it looks like we're about the end of our show. Thanks you guys for so much for coming by. I uh, really can't tell you how much uh, it, it means to us that you brought it by and uh, chose us to show it to the world. So thank you so much. Thanks. Ed Moon, glad you're back in the Mortal Kombat business. Paulo Garcia, John, Paulo, John fantastic. Thank you guys right. so much. Looks great. Really does. Well, 
That's pretty much it for E3 2010 from GameSpot here on the stage. I believe there's a live cam, camera running around still somewhere around here, so you can look at that live feed. Of course, we'll be putting up tons of content over the next few days, wrapping up all the stuff that we shot around here. And uh, yeah, look for more from us uh, over the weekend through the, through the next week. Tons of stuff for E3 still coming, so uh, again, thanks to you guys for coming. Thanks to you all for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Uh, for GameSpot and the entire crew, uh, I'm Ryan McDonald, and uh, yeah, this has been E3 2010. We'll see you guys next week on the spot and all kinds of fun stuff. So take it easy, guys. Hope you enjoyed it.